there has never been a better time to join the world of 3D printing or for experienced makers to upgrade. With the right printer, you can make models, toys, hooks, stands, replacement parts for electronics or a new case for your Raspberry Pi. You can get one of the best 3D printers and plenty of material for well under $300. So, consider what you'll be making with it and watch on to learn more. The two most common types of home 3D printers are resin MSLA or filament FDM. The best 3D printers for beginners or those with children, FDM printers use reels full of plastic filament that is fed into a hot nozzle and extruded out layer by layer to form a solid model. MSLA printers use a UV curved resin material to form a model, layer by layer, as it rises from a vat of liquid that requires very careful handling. We have listed the top 5 3D printers and their key features, plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all products mentioned in the video are in the description below. You can also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, legitpick.com. Number 5. Anycubic Cobra Go The Anycubic Cobra Go is the perfect budget 3D printer for new makers wanting to learn the craft as well as seasoned pros who want a trouble-free second machine. Sure, it doesn't have any fancy touchscreen, but it does have two features that make life easy. Auto bed leveling and PEI coated flex plate. Anycubic kept the cost low, a remarkable $219 by making this version a DIY kit with a cheaper Bowden-style extruder. Its tiny knob control screen might seem like a step backwards, but it's so easy to navigate I didn't even mind. The extra half hour or so spent assembling the printer is well worth the $100 you're saving when compared to the standard Cobra or the similarly kitted out Creality Ender 3v2 Neo. I've seen a lot of sheep printers, and usually they're just machines way past their prime being clearanced out of the warehouse. This is not the case for the Cobra Go, which is a no-nonsense version of the 5-month-old Cobra. You're not buying old tech, but a modern printer with quiet fans, a 32-bit board, silent stepper drivers, and built-in belt tensioners. Number 4. Prusa MK3S Plus Considered the best 3D printer overall by many aficionados, the Prusa MK3S Plus has received countless industry accolades and awards, and with good reason. The MK3S Plus is a powerhouse 3D printer that combines reliable hardware, feature-rich software, and a support channel that makes the Prusa signature black and orange hardware a common sight in the 3D printing farms. The MK3S Plus is based on the i3 platform and has benefited from several generations of incremental upgrades which have resulted in one of the best 3D printers on the market. Silent stepper drivers, removable textured build platforms, automatic bed leveling probe, and more. The list of features that come stock on the Prusa MK3S Plus is certainly impressive, but that's only part of the story with the MK3S Plus. Prusa has developed their own slicer app, Prusa Slicer, for processing 3D models and is actively adding new features requested by the community. Features like the ability to paint on support material, create variable layer heights, and generate custom printer profiles are examples of how Prusa Slicer enables the MK3S Plus to leap ahead of the competition. At a price point of $999 for an assembled printer and $749 for a DIY kit, the MK3S Plus is one of the most expensive machines on this list. That price may raise some eyebrows among 3D printing enthusiasts who have become accustomed to printers in the sub $300 price range, but for power users who need uncompromising performance and industry-leading documentation and support, the MK3S Plus is at the top of the list. Number 3. Dremel DigiLab 3D45 3D Printer Dremel is better known for its rotatory power tools than its 3D printers, but the company put the same care and craftsmanship into the DigiLab 3D45 that it has with its more traditional products. The 3D45 consistently outputs good quality prints in our testing. Plus, the closed frame provides safety to users while prints are in progress. You can print from a computer over a USB, Ethernet, or Wi-Fi connection, as well as from a USB thumb drive. Every Dremel printer can connect via the web to the Dremel Print Cloud, from which you can prepare and launch print jobs, and even monitor prints in progress from an onboard 720p camera. The DigiLab 3D45 is made primarily for product developers, engineers, and other professionals, although it should be useful in education. It was originally designed not as a commercial product, but as a tool for engineers at the Robert Bosch Tool Corporation to use in product design, so it's built to the company's exacting standards. Number 2. Creality Ender 3 S1 Pro 
Realities Ender 3 S1 Pro is the latest and most impressive iteration of the popular Ender 3 line. Not a cheap DIY 3D printer in need of upgrades like its predecessors, the $479 S1 Pro arrives fully loaded, delivering an out-of-the-box experience that's simple for beginners and powerful for experienced makers. The Ender 3 S1 Pro comes mostly assembled and only took us about 15 minutes and a handful of bolts to put together. Bed leveling, the bane of makers new to the hobby, is no longer a worry with Creality's CR Touch Probe. This is by far one of the easiest auto-leveling system we've tested. The list of improvements the Ender 3 S1 Pro has over the humble Ender 3 is massive. It has a Sprite Direct Drive with an all-metal hot end, a PEI-coated steel plex, a color touchscreen, tension knobs, a storage drawer, a light kit, and even a better spool holder. The S1 Pro also comes with a swappable tool head, allowing you to add the optional laser module for engraving. But all of its bells and whistles wouldn't land the Ender 3 S1 Pro at the top of our best 3D printers list if it didn't also provide amazing output. When we printed a variety of detailed models, such as a toy dolphin, a vase, and a beckoning cat, prints were extremely sharp, with fine lines and little to no stringing. In addition to the great models we printed with a PLA filament, we got really strong results when we worked with TPU and PETG filaments. Some green TPU produce lifelike leaves on a potted plant model. Number 1. Anycubic Viper The Anycubic Viper, an open-frame budget 3D printer, provides a large volume print area and support for automatic bed leveling. It comes partially assembled with remaining steps simple and straightforward. As for filament, the Viper supports the standards ABS and PLA, plus TPU and PETG. The printer only comes with a small starter coil, so you will want to buy at least one spool when you buy the Viper. Due to its competitive pricing, generous build area, and automatic print bed leveling, the Viper is a good choice for 3D printing newbies or hobbyists on a budget. Some of our test prints looked a bit rough-hewn, so print perfectionists will want to avoid this one but its minimal assembly requirement shouldn't deter anyone from buying it on that score. So, that wraps up our list of the best 3D printers. Hope you found this video helpful, and if so, please leave a thumbs up as I always appreciate that. Let us know in the comments down below which 3D printer you're going to choose. Thanks for watching, and that's all for this video. If you liked this video and it helped you in any way, please get this video a like, and if you don't want to miss out on any future videos, subscribe to the channel. Hope to see you in the next video. Till next time, see you guys later.